Hello everyone, I'm Philip Manuelov. We arrived to Castle Dinefer or something along these lines and I'm just gonna be walking through the forest that's nearby and gonna be a very peaceful video as I'm assuming so I hope you enjoy it. This is the Dinefer castle. We are currently in its middle ground and it was built by Lord Rhys. And I'll probably insert some commentary later on down the line. And we'll just be exploring it. As you can see again, this castle has a very strategic location. It's on the hill, just overlooking the valley, and there is a river as well, so it's very well situated. And I can definitely see why it was built here. They needed some defenses in the, I guess it was also 12th, 11th century. Again, you can see that the entrance to the castle is from the side. In that way, it's harder to enter the castle when it's been attacked. I presume there was another gate over there. That was destroyed. And the army would have been attacked from the walls of the castle. And there is no way to maneuver to the main gate.
now I've climbed the highest point of the entire castle and probably the valley for over quite a few kilometers. Another day in Wales, we got to Carreg Castle and let's explore it. This is another mostly destroyed castle and you can see it right behind me over there. We found a moment when the weather is not as rainy, so just probably gonna rain in a bit, but let's go and see it. We kind of had to change our plans a little bit, so maybe explore this Karak castle another day and another time. Now moving on to something else. We have now finished our stay in Wales and we'll be going back to London. So if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and leave a comment as well. And I will be joining you with another video series when I go traveling again. And in the meantime, I'll be filming some other videos. See you in the next one. Man, we can't go any further. We just encountered a river in the middle of the road. Nice. Got a bit rainy. Good.